Ready for this handicapper, they're off and racing. A little bit uh, awkwardly away there was Batash Al Khaladia, the blue cap. But as they make their way through the early stages, one of your leaders is Samadair Athbar. Also, Provident is Seyrat Al Dahab. And it's Seyrat Al Dahab that goes on to Mutahed Al Khaladia, who gets into a prominent posse, as indeed does Jara Al Khaladia. That's your leading trio as they make their way through the early stages. Al Muzan is also prominent in the run. Right round the outside is Jasa Al Khaladia as well. They're then followed by the white and black colours of Aga Al Khaladir. And then after that, getting a little bit closer is Jazem Athbar as they make the turn and head towards the levelling up for home. And out in front, it's now Jara Al Khaladir, the red and black colours that's gone on for Alexis Moreno to, in second position, Mutahed Al Khaladir. These two at the head of affairs, followed then in third by Sirat Al Dahab, who's racing in that spot. They're then followed towards the outside by Jasa Al Khaladir. Then up the inside, Al Muzan the last start winner who's getting into this as they start to make the swing for home and out in front it's just uh, Mutahed Al Khaladir but now tackled and passed by Jara Al Khaladir down the centre of the track comes Fertil de Croat who's getting into this late finishing off very strongly down that part of the track as well and it's Fertil de Croat who's picked them all up here Jara Al Khaladir in second then after that is Sierra Al Dahab and racing up towards the line this is going to go in no uncertain terms to Fertil de Croat who's going to win with loads in hand to in second position Jara Al Khaladir they're then followed in third by Agap Al Khaladir then Al Muzan who finished in fourth Tabea Al Naif was fifth yet another winner for Tom Collins Jimmy Carrier aboard Bertil de Croat who's come from a long way